talking about. Disney rehired James Gunn. Oh, did did he get rehired? Oh, <laughs> I uh, wasn't sure. I I, I, I love this so much because they openly admit that they weren't even considering any other directors. That's, I I almost I when I caught that line I was like, were you though? Because like, if that was the case, then why would you fire him? Is this all a PR place? stunt to, to get like the trolls off your back for a year and then go, okay, James, come on. Come on, come on. I mean, <laughs> like, it. I would have accepted it more so as if, like, uh, within the, the weeks after he was fired, they went, guys, honestly, we just made a knee jerk reaction. To be perfectly honest, we didn't yeah. realize that these were things that he had tweeted 10, 12 years ago, and has already apologized for, like... Numerous times. Uh, so it was a knee-jerk reaction. We're really, really sorry. Uh, so he's back. Yeah. But a whole year goes by. Like, it just seemed like they went, uh, wait, hold on. DC hired him for Suicide Squad 2? We gotta get him back! Yeah. We gotta get him back! Yeah. Like, I'll give Dave Batista credit for being, the like, one of the... Like, the whole cast as a whole were all together, but... Batista was like... Oh, he didn't give a shit. He was like, no, you know what? Where I come from, we stick up for, with, for our friends. Yeah, this exactly. Ain't, this ain't cool. Like, everyone was all... <laughs> they were all kind of like, yeah, no, They're, they're tiptoeing on it. Like, well, we're not okay with it, but we'll but, do what you want I mean, us to do. I mean, like, if it's his script, we'll do yeah. it. But you can almost kind of see where they, like, have the script and it's, like, it's crossed out and then crayon like James Gunn and they're like good enough for me yeah that's a James Gunn script right there that's mm-hmm. the one I read whereas like Batista's like fuck that fuck everyone yeah do it just put them on there but so he gets Suicide Squad 2 or 1 or whatever they want to the call Suicide it the Suicide Squad it's a reboot I know all oh, that made me so mad even Michelle was like wait what yeah and I was like yeah yeah it's a reboot she's like why would they do that I was like uh Apparently Warner wasn't happy with the shit ton of money Suicide Squad made. And it shouldn't have? It, I mean, <laughs> Suicide Squad made like fucking 300 million more than Justice League. <laughs> what kind of world do we live in? That's, that's, <laughs> but yeah, okay, so like, uh, we'll do this. So, uh, so James Gunn gets signed on for Suicide Squad 2 and I was like, okay, alright. I was down with it. I'm okay with this. And then they go, uh, yeah, we're recasting uh, Deadshot with Idris Elba. And I was like, all right, okay. All right. And I mean, like I've said before, like I don't think that, you know, Will Smith was necessarily the best choice, but he also wasn't the worst choice. But I'm pumped for Idris Elba. Okay, all right. Uh, they haven't officially said that Margot Robbie's going to be in it, but I don't see why she wouldn't. I think they're kind of waiting to see how well Birds of Prey does to make that decision. Yeah. Yeah, but, I mean, she was a standout of that movie, so I don't Absolutely. see any reason why they Absolutely. wouldn't. Absolutely. But then... So I was like, okay, all right. And then you gave me the cast list of characters, and I was like, okay, so we have those two and arrested characters that I'm familiar with but give zero fucks for. Mm -hmm. King Shark? Yeah, because of The Flash. I'm all over it. Other than that, like, uh, what the hell was one of them? Uh, Poem Man or something? I can't even remember. Uh, Fucking Butterfly Head or I don't fucking... Rainbow Flap Jacket Guy? I don't know. (laughs) Anyway, regardless, all jokes aside... But the second that they said it was a reboot, I was like, why? Jable? Fuck this. And then it, and they're trying to really just get rid of the Snyder universe. They want it out of everyone's mind. You know what? At this point, why not do the same thing that they did with, uh, with Aquaman, where you cherry pick? Mm-hmm. You pick the things that worked, which obviously Surfer Bro Cap, uh, Aquaman works. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, and then... You rejig the other stuff, right? Because they don't really mention it all in Justice League, aside from the one mention of Steppenwolf, right? Yeah. Okay. But then they change everything else to fit their new version. Okay, great. You know, you've got Shazam openly referencing Superman, Henry Cavill's Superman in Shazam. Okay. But that's it. That's it. That's all. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. Do that. Do the same thing that they did with New 52 where they're like, hey, you guys like this stuff about New 50... Or Rebirth, sorry. You like this about New 52, but you like this about old continuity? Yeah. Okay? You don't have to go anything like crazy and totally wipe it off the map. Especially when my wife, who isn't a comic book fan, is like, wait, 
why are you rebooting yeah, it? She's already confused enough with this shit. Yeah. <laughs> she wasn't exactly thrilled that they recast uh, Deadshot. She's a bigger Will Smith fan than I am. Okay. I used to be a huge fan. It's only within the last like five, six years that I'm kind of like hit and miss with him. I still like him. Yeah, well, his choice of movies are kind of weird now. Yeah. I think it's because he's a closet Scientologist, so he's just weird now. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, but yeah, so the the reboot, I was like, okay. And then when they re- uh, Disney's like, he's back, uh, you said it right away. You were like, I'm happy he's back, but that just means we got another five years before we see this fucking movie. Yeah, because he said to them straight up, he's like, thank you so much. I'm doing the Suicide Squad. And they're like, we'll wait for you. And so... Which means, yeah, good five years for Guardians. You know, and I mean, after Endgame, that's now at least four years before we see a Guardians movie, okay? At all. So that's five years of those characters just kind of sitting around going, all right. Unless they make an appearance somewhere else. But... Because we really don't know what the MCU is going to look like now. That's with, true. With them having Fox yeah, and everything. No, I don't. We, we don't know how everything's going to go. No. Um, I read a great article today where someone was saying that Galactus should be the next big bad after yeah, Thanos. And I, I was like, fuck yeah. In fact, they should push it as Doom being the big bad, and then Galactus comes, and Doom has to actually team with the heroes and take Galactus out. Yeah. Yes, please. Yeah, oh, 100%. Because this whole thing with the Marvel Disney buying Fox... Them game Fantastic Four and Surfing Galactus and Doom, that's the best part of it all. For you. The Doom aspect for me is like, yes. Mm. I, I, I've I never been a huge Fantastic Four fan. Yeah. Always been a huge Doctor Doom fan. Always been a huge Doctor Doom fan. Uh, and Silver Surfer, I'm just a sucker for that. You know, I'm not the hugest cosmic guy, but yeah. he... He puts, like, for me, he's like uh, like Star Trek. He's like that Star Trek type of uh, uh, space travel where I'm a huge Star Trek fan, whereas the Guardians are kind of like Star Wars. I think they're better, <laughs> you know? Uh, they There's certainly a lot of really cool things to think about, and uh, hopefully everything turns out the way they That's like. That's kind of nice thing. If Guardians is five years off, that means that technically Gunn, I know he's got a finished script, but now he could have Surfer in there. He could have Star Jammers. He could have The Brood. He can have... Yeah, there's certainly now a huge pocket that of, opens up now. Yeah. Like you could tease Galactus and Guardians. Like 3. even with Captain Marvel, we could also start seeing Nova. Like actual Richard Ryder Nova, not Sam Humphreys. If they go Sam Humphreys, I'm okay. Sam Alexander. Sam Alexander? Humphreys is a, a comic writer. Okay. Yeah. Hey. You might have wrote Don't be a dick, alright? I've been super cool to you all this whole campaign. You guys. just want to say Humphreys. Why would I want to do that? It's a funny sounding word. Mm, why Humph- is it? Humphreys. Hmm. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Think about it. No, I want to hear you say it. Humphreys. Yeah, you keep en- enunciating hump because you're a fucking hard up loser. See what happens when I'm not nice to you? <laughs> anyway. That was great. Um, um, yeah. No, yeah, I, I'm excited. Ultimately, I'm hopeful. I'm, excited I'm disappointed that Suicide Squad 2 is now a fucking reboot. Or The Suicide Squad is a reboot. Because it's dumb. Plus the fact that the characters are now, like, even lower totem pole characters. Yeah. I mean, it's gun, so I, I don't... Polka anticipate... Dot Man, that's who it was. Yes, that's right. Polka Dot Man. <laughs> like, it's going to be one of those where you're like, you know, if it was anyone else, this is probably going to be the worst fucking movie. Yeah, but because but... it's gun... That's right. <clears throat>